back to the channel, folks. Boobiddle. Where's Boobiddle? Boobiddle is Bo nowhere to be found. Bo? Bo? Oh, you're not Bo. <laughs> you got a big smile, though. Look <laughs> at you. So we are back here at Easy Repair in Detail. I got hey, it right. you got it right for the first time. <laughs> Did you, for did, as long as I've known this guy, this is the first right? time he's gotten it right. Completely apologize. It's okay. It's, it's horrible. I'll hold it against it's, you. We're, we got to be professional and say the names so, right. I promise we are professional. So, yes, his info... As, is, as he's crossing his fingers. Right, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> his info is on the screen. We'll rely on that being correct. And today, we are coming down to finish up this... Yes. Talk to us about this. This is a, what, 78 Corvette... C3. Yes. yes. Uh, and there's a story behind it, right? There is a story. So, so of give, course, it, give us the quick rundown on so, it. So the car came from GC Performance Classics. We'll just uh, throw their info Jer on the screen yes, real quick. Yeah, Jeremy, Jeremy, of course, over there. He called me five months ago. He said, AZ, I have a client. Uh, this car was originally bought by the customer that we're doing it for, from, by his father. Okay. His father's really, really sick. So it's like a family heirloom at this it, point. It is, but he just wants his father to take one last ride in it before he gets super sick to the point where he cannot ride it. Can't anymore. ride it, okay. So this is what he's doing. He's trying to bring it back to life. It was silver with a black bottom, like a dark charcoal on the bottom. Two-tone-ish. Two-tone-ish, that's right. They were and very now, common in that era. Now it's one beautiful black color. And what that's color exactly. is this? Like triple black or black black? It or? says it's black as you can Jet black is jet what we black. call it, yes. Okay, there you go. Uh, it's super as black as you can get. Solid as black. It's still a base coat, clear coat, obviously. We didn't put single stage on it, as you've seen in the other videos. Yeah, that's right. Uh, but the story behind it, of course, it made me want to do it even more when he told me what he was trying to do. Yeah. He gave us a timeline. We're a little bit behind, but not by much. We were rain on parts a little bit on front and rear bumpers, a spoiler. Uh, he bought an aftermarket spoiler for it that we had to mount and pre-fit before we painted. Okay. Uh, but he came and seen it, so I think he's... He's ready to go. He's, he's ready to he's, take that yeah, ride. Yeah, absolutely. And of it, course, he's got to go back to GC for them to put all the jewelry, the jewelry, all jewelry the, back on. All the vents, the lights, all the bells and whistles. All the fun stuff. All basically. the fun stuff that makes it look pretty, right? So, right, and so, uh, so as a theory, like we want to kind of make sure folks understand, like this uh, 993 Porsche over here just needed a bumper, right? Yep. This is a complete, complete paint job, right? So it you, is. You do both. You I don't do take both. on a lot of these. It has to kind of be a special uh, thing, right? It's it does. Make so sense. if it's somebody that really that means something to them, that wants to get it done right, then of course I want to do it. Yeah. If it's somebody that's just trying to. Flip one, I'm not the guy to do it. Right, me. exactly. Uh, just, so not. so if you're interested and you have, like, this is one of our other buddies, uh, Charles at Direct Auto. Uh, oh, it's another one of the family heirlooms it, it, that he's it had is. for this, years. He's, he's restoring this for his wife. So this one. Uh, will, so it means something, right? right? It's not just somebody saying, hey, I want a, I want a cheap paint job. And or uh, you know, no offense to any other shops or anything. Right. I want a, I want a cheap paint job and I want to flip it. Right. This is not one of those. That's not this what is you do. No, I like fixing things for people that care about it. That's a car car guy themselves, just like me. Right. I'm really big into cars, obviously. Well, you can see this <laughs> if you stand just some of these cars that are in here. Like clearly, this is a car guy's car. There's another, another older 911 that's definitely yeah. a car guy's car. This car is getting a wide body. It is. On it. That S2000 only has 10,000 miles. So, again, another car guy. And just, car just guy. so we make the note, you took the original fenders off yes. so that if he wants to put it back That's to stock, it can go 100% Absolutely. Back. We've kept the So he's not ruining the S2000, folks. He's, he's not ruining it by any means. He's just doing stuff that he wanted to do to one. He found one that he wanted to do that to right. uh, without damaging anything. If he ever wanted to, we can always put the original parts back on and make it look like it make never it. make it look like it never happened, right? Never happened, yeah, exactly. Uh, we're not modifying anything outside of what you would just replace parts with. Right, right. Uh, so, okay, so let's zero in on exactly what stage we're in now. So, uh, Daniel's over here Daniel's over doing here. something with some kind of liquid. What what, <laughs> <laughs> what, uh, what, is the, what stage is he in? Clearly, we're getting close to the end of the project so here. So, this is the polishing stage. We've already wet sanded. We've already cut all of our sand scratches out of the clear. Uh, what we're doing right now is just polishing, putting wax on the vehicle. Okay. Uh, so he's polishing and waxing at the same time. So it's kind of like the jewelry. You're doing the jewelry. I am. You're this is our the... last touch. Last this touch. Last touch. We still have the hood to put on. That'll go on tomorrow uh, or but, even later today. Right. Uh, go on later today. And then uh, they'll put, of course, GC Performance will put the rest of the stuff on. Awesome. Uh, but the hood is buffed and ready to go as well, sitting on a stand behind you. Uh, but we'll... Uh, but you can zoom in on him and you can see 
uh, on, on, on the, what he's doing if you want. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. What we'll do is we'll cut to the time lapse of this man working this car over. Uh, and then once he gets finished, we'll come back and kind of do a once over with you guys and Absolutely. finish this thing out. You excited? Yes. <laughs> he's excited because when this is done, y'all well, get to go home. <laughs> well, that and I mean, he's been through this process with me, right? Well, yeah. Talk a to a us a little a bit about Aon. This a a is Aon's my oldest son. Okay. He's my only son. So if you're wondering, <laughs> this is a family business. This Here is. it is, family, he right is here. Summer school, and no summer school. He's out for the summer, so. He so, likes hanging out with that. That's awesome, dude. It is. So it, hopefully it'll carry over at the very least. Like, I don't know that I want you to be a body guy when you grow up, but if you could be a painter like your dad, that'd be pretty slick, man. <laughs> <laughs> let's man. cut Let's cut to this guy doing yeah. some, uh, doing some. what is it, buffing? Buffing. Not polishing. Polishing, polishing. Yeah, okay. he is polishing. Let's cut to the time lapse of this man doing some polishing. So it's all done, as y'all can see, all the way around the car is super shiny, super clean, super polished, super everything. And man, it just, I've seen this every stage of this paint. And yeah. dude, yeah. this <laughs> looks, amazing. It looks amazing. What do you think? You like it? Yes. You a fan of the black? No, yes. yes. If it was your car, what color would you paint it? I think red or blue. I really don't blue, okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know, uh, not everybody likes black, but this man sure did. And let's kind of do a little walk and talk. I want to uh -huh. kind of point and shoot here a little bit on this. Uh, so I don't think you got the first stages of this, Ben, when it first came when in. When it first came in, yeah. No. So this thing had like, it was crow's foot is what we call it, right? Where the paint is just cracked completely everywhere. Centimeter by centimeter, it was all cracked. It was god awful. Uh, I'll send you a photo so you can post it in the, uh, in the video and show it. It was god awful. So to see, for me to see that it's at this stage, yeah, and being able to do do that to a vehicle, it feels amazing. It's a, yeah, and the it whole really does. beginning, I mean, like your eyes saw it in horrible condition. Well, and I mean, now, so if I said I did it all by myself, I'd be lying. But it's yeah, it takes know, an amazing team to do so. This guy uh, specifically, I mean, look, he's been working hard all day. <laughs> Y'all uh, seen him a couple times in the videos. He broke he broke some dance moves out earlier. Yeah, <laughs> I bet he did. He did for sure. Uh, but yes, yeah, so, I mean, to have an amazing team that can be able to do this to a vehicle, it's a great feeling. Uh, and being able to do, like I told you the story about it earlier, uh, for the gentleman, I think he'll love it. Uh, it's still unbelievable to see where it came, where it started from, to see it now. Yeah. Uh, of course, we're gonna install the hood later get that finished up and then it goes to GC performance uh, tomorrow so and it's on its way out well yes and hopefully that gentleman gets more than just one good ride yeah and then <laughs> like after they get all put, uh, put together maybe we can uh, take a look at it maybe we can yeah we'll do some photos or yeah go check it yeah, out we'll go check it out maybe we can walk in on them while they're putting it together yeah yeah that's a good idea that's a good idea putting the what'd yeah. you say the, jewel, yeah, I mean, the like jewelry the, right jewelry yeah so I mean, of course like so the tail lights of course are not in none of these lights there's a big spoiler that goes on right here uh, that will look amazing when it's on. You got the gas lid door that's out. There's a panel, that, a painted panel that goes in here. There, there's still a lot of stuff that has to be done to the vehicle. Yeah, well, and they can see like the interior isn't applied. And these are all things that uh, absolutely. once all it gets over GC performance, they'll kind of finish it off. Yes, sir. Uh, which is all part of the plan. So, folks, thank you so much for watching AZ. Aon, we really appreciate y'all letting us jump in on your family business yeah, and uh, and see the fruits so of your labor. Here. This car looks so cool. You know, from any angle, it just has that shine. And I don't know that I'm a fan of the look of these cars, but I know like there's a lot to be said about 
needing more power and more brakes, more everything else. Or there well, was I mean, back the, then. For the know? era, though, you right, have to for the think, 70s. Uh, yeah. yeah, of course. For the 70s, I don't think they were bad. For right. us, they're terrible well, right the look, now for what we have in our hands now. Right, but like looks wise, they don't make them like this. No, and absolutely not. It, they I'm, still make a fiberglass, but not like this. Not like this, yeah. And it's cool. It's really cool to. To, to the heritage, I'm pretty familiar with the heritage of Corvettes and stuff, so it, it's really cool to see one of these saved. I guess that's yes, the way to put it. Absolutely, I'm glad it's saved too. So, well, dude, your info has been on the screen. Thank yeah, you again thank you for so much. letting us come in here. For my man Aon or AZ, <laughs> I am Ben Barber. We will see you guys in the next video.